Ohio woman deemed too fat to tan and denied a refund. Now, yeah, the headline sounds pretty damning, and the story's even more damning, and I'm on her side. While I do understand that obesity is a problem in this country, America, I gotta tell you, I'm standing with Kelly on this one. The Aloha Tanning Salon in Norton gladly accepted Kelly McGreevy's $70 in exchange for a month-long tanning package, but when McGreevy came in to get the tan last to get her first tan last week Tuesday. Um, she was told to st- the stand-up bed was broken and the traditional bed was off limits to customers weighing over 230 pounds. She then asked for her money back, which she was denied by management. According to the Channel 3 News, Aloha Tanning has an F rating by the Better Business Bureau. And to make matters worse, they wouldn't give her her money back. She did not get her $70 back. And here's my problem with this whole thing, right? I get it. She's oh, she's overweight. Or, it, depending, I'm, I'm, I've never met Kelly, so I don't know. Kelly could be morbidly obese. I don't know. I don't know. Right? And I do believe that we need to be, we need to do a better job in this country educating people about the food choices that they make. But this is not a commentary about food choices, America. This is a commentary about straight up fairness. She never used the service whatsoever why does she not get her 70 dollars back is there was there anywhere in the clause where it said that she can she couldn't get any refunds right and and this is and this and also this is not really her fault so even if yes she was overweight and the the tanning bed the lay down tanning bed or the just a traditional tra- tanning bed was unavailable that's not her fault it's the fault of the it's the fault of Aloha Tanning to make sure the stand up bed is available so bigger people can use the stand up bed instead of the lie down bed or the traditional bed. Either way, Kelly deserves her refund. Point blank. Period. She needs her seven dollars back. She never used the service. She never will have a chance to use the service because their stand up bed does not work. So Kelly, we have your back here at Fowler Show. And for Aloha Tanning, you're on our you are on our list. You're on our list, Aloha Tanning. You are on our list. You're like the asshole of the week, Aloha Tanning. You really are. And I hope that you get shut down and you run out you get run out of business and nobody goes to your store. And I hope that all the people that are over 230 pounds definitely boycotts your store. And I hope that anybody who has a friend or a family member that's over 230 pounds, they should boycott your store too. Because you don't give refunds after the service was new. So there's nothing to do that she was fat or not fat. It was the fact that she paid her $70 and you guys gave her no more money back. She wants her money back. What happened to the money back guarantee? Lost. Gone. Stolen her $70. She deserves to get it back.